That's a slow ass motherfucking rap. This next contest is scheduled for one fall and is another tag team match for crown the number one contenders. Oh, we know this theme music. It's about to stink in a minute. Cause we about to get some pieces of shit to come out here. And wrestle this, this tag team tournament match. Mm -hmm. Ryan Stevens. Arguably the greatest tag team wrestler in BWA's history. Kill switch. Team POS coming off, fresh off that War Games match win. I was hoping Ryan Steve was going to jump over the top rope too. Gentlemen, uh, I'm still not too familiar with these guys' theme song. So if, I, who I, if it is who I think it is, yes, it's, a, it's a Nigma and Trevor Cash who were, they were unsuccessful. They were unsuccessful against the murder two weeks ago in the section, but they're getting their second chance. They're getting a, they're in this tournament in hopes to climb back up and get one more shot at the Tag Team Champions. Checking all four men, checking the tag teams, the weapons. I think should check Team POS twice. They might be hiding a chicken bone or something. Enigma are trying, they're trying to, you know, intimidate Ryan Stevens. He must not be familiar with Ryan Stevens. They're <laughs> trying to intimidate that guy. <laughs> I right, said so they got the Team POS got the momentum. They just won war games. They got the momentum rolling with them. Uh, and Trevor uh, yeah. like I said Nigma tried to intimidate Ryan Stevens. He must not be aware of who Ryan Stevens is. <laughs> but once he catches one of those forearms, he might get a very rude awakening. Shout out to the nigga Rick. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I'm your commentator, Ryan Zane. I'm your master of ceremonies, the man of power, the man of power, tall as a tower, longer down there than an hour. And we're <laughs> oh, fuck it, I'm just fucking around. And we're going to, and we're going to the collar level tie up. <laughs> Ryan Stevens backs him up into a corner. Hoping for a clean break. Hoping for a clean break. Oh! Top from Ryan Stevens. Oh, one of those thunderous forearms of his. Oh, that hurt my penis. And Ryan Stevens in control of this match. Oh, snap man with authority here. Look at the, look at the hold. Got a light locked under the chin. Referee's probably checking, make sure it's not a choke. Goes for a front chin lock there. Ryan Stevens in control. Never <laughs> trying to stay in this match because Ryan Stevens can be a submission wrestler if need be. He doesn't have to a lot of the time. Oh, 
Going for the elbow, trying to break the hold. I never. Oh! And a throw down. Ryan Stevens, the veteran of the BWA, former two time BWA champion, former United States champion, multiple times. I can't even count how many times he's been a tag team champion. So this is nothing new to Ryan Stevens. <laughs> Some of these guys, a lot of these guys look like they don't want to be here today. Mark Williams earlier, Ryan Stevens now. He just does, he just looks like he could be anywhere else but here. Ooh, Controlling the pace. Uh, the Enigma usually wrestles a pretty fast pace. Oh, and a, just a face wash. Oh, followed by another. His face got to be clean after those two face washes right there. Kills us, pull them out. One, two, oh. I don't know what happened first, that he got the shoulder up or Trevor Cash broke the count. Either way, it was not a three count. Kill Swift in control of this match. Goes for the sleeper hole. Shout out to the Piper. Got locked right under the chin. And the perfect L. Referee. Oh, look at that. Twisting the neck. Perfectly legal. Look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, that's not legal. That's not legal. Yeah. We can expect that from a piece of shit. I, I'm just pure. I'm, just, no, my, I'm, I'm Ryan Zane. We are joined here. Ryan Stevens. We're joined here. Come out here and talk to. We're joined by Eric Spade, ladies and gentlemen, on commentary as he watches his, his brothers in, in arms try to compete to for the tag. Well, Watch for the number of the ship. Wrestlers in the Oh my back. God. That's who they are, Mr. Commentator Man. They are. Watch Greatest well, tag team wrestler ever, right there. But I mean, you, both of you can make the argument, Eric. Who you come from, man? Oh. Not to, not to, not to, not to take I'm just a commentator. I don't want to take anything away from Eric Spade, but you can also argue that you're one of the greatest tag team wrestlers of all time. I'm going to give it up to my boy Ryan Stevens. He has had the tag team titles, I think, twice more than me. Just, just twice with more? With two different other partners. Oh, well, so I'm going to go ahead and give it up. I'll be second best. Okay. That, well, that, that, that's fair. That you would give credit. To, oh! Oh, what a close line. He needed okay. that one. It's okay. Oh, and the tag. Right, no. He needed the tag. Trevor, Trevor got us in. Wearing the pink and black attack. Which you did not just say that. I mean, he's wearing pink and black. I mean, it was all... not talk about Bret Hart in the presence of Ryan Stevens. Well, I was talking about the legendary Stu Hart, who's trained dozens and dozens of wrestlers in his day. Don't, don't like die. Lance Storm, don't me, Chris me. Jericho. I know who you were talking about. I mean, I've been talking about Owen Hart, Jimmy Anvil, Knight Hart. Uh, uh... Yeah, Owen Hart, I hear his career took a little bit of a fall. Oh, oh come on. Come on. You, you, know, you are a piece of shit, Eric Spade. What did I say? What did I say? What did I say? Owen Hart's career took a fall. How dare you? See, that's the gut. intelligence of Ryan Stevens. Oh, you think these two noobs can get in the ring with Ryan Stevens? I mean, go toe -to -toe? Trevor Cash and Enigma, yes, they are new to the BWA, but they have been wrestling for years. They've been wrestling together yeah, they have for not years. The caliber of talent of Stevens and Killswitch. Well, that, well, you might be right. We have some of the best talent in backyard wrestling here in the BWA. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, what a shot by Killswitch. Eric May, I know you have to Killswitch feel here, he is the future of BEWA. This man is a future champion in the making. Well, he will be BEWA champion. Well, he's already held the tag team titles. He's already held the United States and championship. And the BEWA championship is next. Is next? Are you sure? I'm absolutely yeah. sure. I know you have to We're be grooming this man for the BEWA championship. Well let's, well, let's not right now talk about the future. Let's talk about the past. Two weeks ago, how do you feel about coming out that huge win? Oh. Uh, 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 the war games match of the century. Oh, was well deserved. Was there any doubt that Team POS was going to beat TakeOver? TakeOver is the past. POS is the future. TakeOver yeah, are just you... trying to recapture lost glory that they gave up because they couldn't get along, because they couldn't cohesively exist with one another. And let me tell you something, it will happen again. They but, will implode. But, but Eric Spade, 
you had to have some type of doubt when it was three to one, when all the rest of your team was left in the ring. No. J Slash, you had no. Ray Black in there, you had Jacob Practice, you had, you had Ronald Scott no. up in the ring. J Slash, J Slash, no. J Slash is a survivor. He will always live. See, Ronald Scott can put it on a shirt, but Ronald Scott doesn't live it like J Slash does. He's the real survivor of BWA. Come on, Eric. You can't kill J Slash. He's got 900 lives. He knows the Konami code. Eric, what? Eric, man. But you got to realize, you got to know that you had a lot of help. You had a huge assist. You had three other men. You had the members of Royals to come and attack Jacob Price and Ronald Scott and help eliminate Ray Black. We didn't you ask had, them. You we had, didn't ask them, Bill. You had Roland Habit, the current BWA champion. Yank, no, 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 yank no, no, Jacob Black is out of his shoes, no, damn no. here. I don't know what you're talking about. We didn't ask him to come out. We take advantage of the opportunities that are put in front of us. You pretty much, with your four guys going to match, you pretty much had eight. You had four guys extra to help you win the War Games match. And you feel good about that? We're you, feel calm? you feel good about that win? We're going to take advantage of the opportunities given to us. Ha! See, Ryan Stevens knows. Ryan Stevens doing what he has to win. When to break it up. He knows when to get in there. Grace Tagra, watch out. Oh, shit. Uh, oh. Trevor Cash. Oh, Eric Spade uh, taunting Trevor Cash here. Kill switch. Kill switch looks like he'll take the kill. What? What? Kill switch. Oh! Kill switch just hit the three pin split. <laughs> On Trevor Cash, Riku Heartless and Enigma all on the floor. Kill switch through. Trevor Cash better goes for the cover. One, two. Oh! Bar barely a two. Well, the referee said it was a one. A tag. A tag from Kill Switch. Eric Spade taunting Enigma and Riku Heartless. Kill Switch and Ryan Stevens were double teaming. And the Trevor Cash, he has the, the reverse armbar. Toast it's in right there. Future. Is he not the most exciting wrestler in this company? Look at him. I mean, it is debatable. Kill Switch is a very entertaining wrestler to watch. There's no taking away from his athleticism. But you got his a lot of young talent here in the BWA yet to break out. Well, yeah, I think I think Ryan Stevens said that Trevor Cash is fighting. Oh, and roll over back into the arm bar. Oh, and Enigma breaks over. What a perfect arm bar by Ryan Stevens. Broken up by Enigma. Both these tag teams will be a perfect. The only tag team will be a challenge for the murder. The current reigning tag team champion. Oh. Got lucky. That was a hard shot that to the face. Luck. That was a great four-way dance tag team match. And he's just having to come up with a tag belt. They beat your guys. They beat your guys in J Slash. Illegally. They had help. Let's let's oh. right across the face. Kill switch with a great save. One, two. Oh, kill switch. Had his eyes on Enigma. I hope he broke his nose. He might have. I hope he didn't. Damn, it's my partner. Yeah, I don't give a fuck about your partner. I give a fuck about my partner. Shut up. Kill don't switch. Go my lawn, Going bitch. over. Oh. What a. Oh, and a corkscrew. One. Get him out of there. Eric Spade, a piece of shit for that very what? racist what? comment what? to Enigma. What did I say? <laughs> he asked Enigma to mow his lawn. Is he not Mexican? Um, I'm not sure. <laughs> Mexican. He says he's Puerto. He say, I think he says he's Puerto Rican. It's all the same difference to me, isn't it? Oh my God! <laughs> well, then, have ladies and gentlemen, Eric Spade does not represent the, the views of the BEWA. Oh, what a drop kick! <laughs> Hooks him up. Oh! One, two. Ladies and gentlemen, that was actually the Brain Buster. The Brain Busters are highly. I'm going to submit a complaint. It's a very different move. To the owner of this company for that referee. I'm going to have his job. Well, the referee, I mean, the owner quit. So, who, are you going to play in the Rocky Fantasy DOA? Does he have the authority to fire a referee? I believe he does. Yes. <laughs> I'm asking you. What, what do tag? you know? And the tag. Oh, and the name is the tag. Oh. Oh, and they want a shot. Another shot. Another shot. Yeah. Hey, he puts him in the corner. Oh, he's taking the blows with him. <laughs> and Neyman's got, he's got Ryan Stevens in the corner. Watch his cash. 
Oh, oh, a jumping forearm shot. Oh, and a DDT. Enigma in control. But something tells me he's going to pay for that jumping forearm later. <laughs> And that's and that's just my experience as a commentator. I watched a lot. I watched a lot of a lot of Ryan Stevens matches over the years. If anything I know, if you try to forearm him, you are going to pay for it later. He will. It's coming, and you won't see it coming. Nigga has a chin lock with the knee in the spine to stretch it out even more. No. No. Shots across the chest. After all the pain, has an energy to call Enigma incompetent. Such big words during the tag team match. talking to the referee. Oh. The referee is incompetent. Well, I thought he was talking about to his opponent. Either way, it would have worked. I think this referee went to school in D.C. I don't think he can count high enough. Oh, well, well, well. That's not for debate. We have, we have no problems with our fans in D.C. Stop maybe, lying, maybe, maybe, maybe Team POS doesn't like the District of Columbia all too well. <laughs> but the BWA has a lot of supporters in DC, in Maryland, in Virginia, and all over down the East Coast. It's, um, and it's a shithole. I don't know a man by that name. Uh, uh, Shut the up. DC is not a shithole. Who is Keith Isn't Warren? Is Keith Warren is from? <laughs> That's just Keith Warren. You shut up over there. Who is Keith? beat the shit out of you. Come on. These two wrestlers, Eric Spade and Rico, I was talking about Keith Warren. I never heard of this man a day in my life. I, 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 oh, the last round. There's a lot of men wearing he wears a cowboy hat. James Storm. Like people talk out the side of their necks. J James Storm wears a cowboy hat. I'm going to smack you, commentator. Why are you going to smack a helpless commentator? <laughs> you are a piece of shit, Eric Spade. Come take a match. I'm getting frustrated. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Trevor Cash is controlling this match. <laughs> I'm not competent. I've been calling this match the way it is. Brian Stevens gets the tag. Comes down. No! Oh, the STF! Brian Stevens down on the down on the floor. Eric Spade is trying to help Kill Switch out here. He's pushing the ropes towards Kill Switch. Oh! With Eric Spade's help. With Eric Spade's help, Kill Switch makes it to the ropes. I just saw you. I saw you through my monitor. Oh! The jumping kick to the face by Trevor Cash. I was just trying to straighten the rope out. Trying to straighten the rope. I think it was. It was. It was. It was crooked. The ring crew fixed the ropes earlier. It was crooked. Oh, he's going no. for the three amigos. What? Is he what? trying to do? Something? Oh, no. goes for the north. Oh, he stops with the northern he suplex. He out of it. He braids the northern suplex, but kills Swiss man to get the shoulder up. The fans. Are, the fans are dead in here. He's got too much swag. That's why I'm here to liven it up. You hit it live and up, we'll right. commentary. These oh, fans Enigma. Wrestling. Enigma just crowned kill switch. Here we go. The one, two. And he got the shoulder up. Yes, sir, X That's why you stopped talking. I mentioned the crown. From your, you told me one time what's your favorite movie. I, I, I thought that, you know. It, no, what's we, my favorite movie? I thought, I, thought we, I thought because it was your favorite movie, it, you know, it'd be cool, you know. What are we talking about? I say crown him. They're ready to rumble, you know. You really think Ready to Rumble is my favorite movie? I, mean, I thought you were David Arquette then. No. Je oh, Jeff Jarrett. Don't insult me. Jeff Jarrett. No. I'm really going to smack the shit out of you. <laughs> Diamond House Page. Um, I'm gonna have this rest cycle, job cycle. in yours. Sid Vicious. You did not just say that. I, I, I don't know. I, just thought, I thought, no, that's what someone told me. You know, I met Sid Vicious once. I told him, I told him, I said, Sid, go out there in that ring and break a leg. <laughs> oh my God. You are a piece of shit, Eric Spade. My God. <laughs> Speaking of pieces of shit, how, how, how is. Watch this. Oh, whoa! The athleticism of Kill Switch. <laughs> But Eric Spade, how is the recovery going for, for a former world champion, Austin Extreme, right now? He's getting out of the hospital soon. That was nice. He's got some broken bones. He's going to need to recover. They got him in a neck brace. He's, he lived. And Damien's going to pay for what he did. Because I know he did it. So are you, are you claiming that Damien Fatale I am claiming that Damien did it. Ran over Austin Extreme. And that is why I asked. 
for the match with Damien. Oh, oh my God. Oh. The six second magic from yeah. Kill Switch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Although when you get Kill Switch in the match, like six hour magic. Oh my God. <laughs> 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 And Trevor Cass kicked the shit out of Kill Switch. That's what he gets! Ryan Stevens back to his feet. They cheated. <laughs> they attempted to injure Ryan Stevens. Ryan Stevens looks like he's hurt. He had a bloody lip and a bloody nose, and they had to attend to him. Oh, medical. And look, Kill Switch. Well, I may, not, I may not like Team Beast of shit, but this ain't ballet. This is wrestling, and Brian Stevens is a tough guy. Everyone in this fight is our tough guy. So a little bit of blood ain't going to stop this match, ladies and gentlemen. See, look, back. <laughs> just wipe the blood up a little just bit. We're going to put a tamp on his nose, and he'll be able to continue the rest of this match. But right now, back to the cops. Oh, what a low blow by Enigma. You, who would have known they would have stooped to such tactics? Oh, the discus. Oh, man. That is not going to be good. One, two, oh, and a kick to the head. Ryan Stevens pulling kill switch out of the ring. Eric Spade. Two, three, fuck this shit. What? Wait, I think, are they leaving? Are they leaving? Team piece of shit left. I guess these guys win by counter. Double <laughs> cast the name of one. Huh? La ladies and gentlemen, the winners of this match by via count out are Trevor Cast and Enigma. And they will advance. They will face Mark Williams and Elric later on today. And whoever wins will be the number one contenders for the tag team titles. Going to the damnation for You win by count. Win by count. Two round match and no more contenders. Uh, I, I, I don't. I don't think. I don't think that they, they still have to face Mark Williams and Elric later on today, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> 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 Not today. Not today. Not today. Not today. At damnation. At damnation. Will they have to wrestle twice at damnation? At damnation. Will they? Will they? Will they? On the spot. On the spot. On the spot. On the spot. <laughs> you understand? We're not here to. Bullshit with Team Piece of Shit. <laughs> they want to know who Tennis Matches should have been out here, they should have fought. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we know. Shit's like they are walking out. <laughs> team Matches is here for business, and we're here for the tag team titles. These colors sure as shit don't run. They, they want for the tag team they, wait for, they want the tag belts. What, what we do know is, ladies and gentlemen, they have to go through Mark Williams and Elric before they get another shot at the murder. And we'll be back with our next match after these messages. <laughs> We have advertisers. Hey, what's going on? I'm oh, sorry. I need my. Hold up. Metal, okay. Oh. I'm lazy. Sorry. Yeah. That was fun. <laughs> <laughs> I felt like coming out and helping you out live in that little. Like, oh my god, yeah, because I was like dead out here. I was like, ah. What? He's dead out here. You good? Who's on camera next? It's a, it's a, I'm going to be after this. Jay, can you record this? I'm going to be next, but it's the villain.